How do you feel? It's your birthday trip. I'm out here in Miami. What are what are your expectations for the trip? Looking for them with your daddies. Oh my fucking goodness. <laughs> Say bye. See you tomorrow at the airport. Today we are going to Miami, baby. Mm. I'm going to Miami, eh, looking for the hoochie daddies. I'm mad hype right now. I'm waiting for my lift. I'm already packed, ready. Last week was Melanie's birthday, so we're going on a little one-to-one-two -one -two trip to Miami. It's gonna be her first time, her and Tara. We're going to one of her friends, Tara, so it's me, Melody, and Tara. This is gonna be their first time in Miami, and this is gonna be like my fourth. Like, I love Miami, and Miami just always brings, like, vibes. <laughs> Best to be employed. <laughs> I was, uh, Ella and I were laughing because when they did the loudspeaker, they were... No, they were like, if you have one, if you have more than one, they are very strict with the luggage policy. That's why I said, put my bag over. Tell you, one piece of luggage only. <laughs> one piece. I say, do it now. Don't let them stop you when you are on the line. I bust that laughing. And he said African too. Oh, he is? He probably said African too. I don't really sit, but I'm like thugging it out. And I think I'm doing a great job. Please, when we land, let's get some Red Bulls in the building. I mean, You brought what? Liquid IV. What time did you set it for? One. One p.m. So you know we're going to Nikki Beach tomorrow, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, are you excited? Okay. Yeah. I'm too excited. They try to charge me for a while. But then this really nice girl offered to take some of my stuff into her bag. Because she was checking her bag. I would have paid $100 for a carry-on. I want to say this is the last time I'll fly. Oh, shit. Excuse me. I'm sorry. <laughs> No ma'am. Somebody told me, someone collected my load for me. I oh, put it in her bag. The girl with the big with suitcase. Oh yeah? Yeah, because oh. she was checking it in. Oh, okay. So she was like, I can take some stuff for you and then yeah. I took her phone number. Oh, what you call it? The guy was He's like, such an asshole. He was like, well, he was like, ma'am. I said, he's like, this is all you have? I said, yeah. yeah I saw that. I, like, I think she had something and she just kept walking. Yeah. Such an asshole. Miami Gialis, we out here, just landed, about to cause some problems out here. It's hot as hell, I don't know what I was thinking, yeah. not work. Crop top. And today is not the day we are done that. What is our time? Uh, five minutes away. What is oh, driver is here. What kind of car is it? A Tahoe. Good morning, y'all. So it is 11:30 a.m. I don't know if I told you guys yesterday, or if I ever had a chance to tell you guys yesterday, but I'm not feeling too well. I feel like heavy congestion in my nose, throat area, and then I don't think the flight helped too, like the pressure of the flight with my eardrums. So like my whole my neck up just feels funny. But this trip, I've been planning and anticipating this trip for about a month. So I am being a trooper 
and you know i'm just trying my best to keep my energy up even in ways that i probably shouldn't like i already had a red bull this morning but i also took it like with a side of mucinex so um yeah i feel i feel a little weird but i don't want to so i'm smoking a lot of pot and i am drinking a lot of water i'm drinking a lot of red bull and i'm, drinking, I'm just taking a little bit of everything or a lot of everything melody and tara are getting dressed we got a three bedroom Airbnb apartment and it's like in such a perfect look. We're going to Nikki Beach today. I think our reservation is for like 1 p.m. and it's 11.30 so I'm about to start getting ready. And then we're gonna go have some drinks, eat some food, and see what the city just gives us. Like we have an itinerary but like we're also kind of going with the flow. I'm not really a go with the flow type of girl. If you guys don't know that, I mean you should. But I'm trying my best. We have this pocket spaces of time um, that are not like itemized stuff to do that. I feel like we could do one or two things. Like we have a pool downstairs, a hot tub. You know, it'd be nice to check that out one of these nights. Like last night was a cool vibe. We went to Victory Lounge. I like Victory because they used to be in DC before. So I went there a couple of times when they were in DC and it wasn't so bad. But uh, so expensive. <laughs> really was but it was a vibe it was cute you know i have my cute little one two dress it was, it was a cute the whole vibe it was just a nice little chill evening i'm not sure why i got the master but i did and i'm grateful because then i get to smoke off the balcony but the closet is what is insane look at this shit and just me and in my true self my true fashion i already unpacked everything i'm thinking this two-piece um i got it from gt online you know just something slight She would have hit us. Yeah, That's true. At the back. She is lucky. Call Nikki Beach, Miami. We're late per usual. But they will be running late for your reservation, okay? Appreciate it. Thank you. This is why she came to Miami. At least this was like top two reasons why. Top two. Top two. I'm not two. I hate it though. I love it. But she's still mm. drinking it though. Twenty-two dollars. Excuse me. Let the people know that you're good. <laughs> I love the beach and I will not deprive myself of probably the only beach time we're gonna have because tomorrow we have a dinner and we don't really have plans for Sunday night but we're just gonna see how it goes but I wanna go near the water. I just wanna feel it for a little bit. 
yeah man we're gonna go to have some afro fusion party on friday so you know we're africans we gotta go where the africans are <laughs> Yeah. Hey, shut up. <laughs> the days are beginning to all be a blur. Saturday evening, it's around 4.50. We have a dinner at 6.30. I'm about to start getting ready. And I just wanted to catch you guys up on what we've been up to today, which is basically nothing. Um, I've been sick, like I've been saying, for the past, the whole entire video. And I felt like I kind of overdid it last night. So today, we all got some much needed rest. Like I didn't get out of bed till like 11 a.m. and we got I got in, I got to bed or I went to bed at like 3 a.m. So I had like a good eight hours in and out because of my cough and whatever. And then I had some coffee, went back to sleep. Just I've been sleeping and coughing all day. And then I had to get an enema done because a bitch is constipated. And there was a pharmacy downstairs. I got a little saline solution and Melody had her. Face all up in my ass trying to help me but i got it together because i needed to make some space for dinner i'm about to have tonight we're going to sexy fish it's like a very popular restaurant in miami i think they also have one in london and i've always wanted to go so we're going there tonight and then we'll see where the night takes us so i'm just gonna get ready um and show you guys my outfit show you guys everyone's outfit and then yeah Between me and you, I feel a like chemistry. 